everybody, Eric from Lock and Lunatics. We got a 10 by 15 over here today. Um, not a lot in there. Have I done a good thing? Have I done a bad thing? We don't really know. Something in there caught my eye. Let's take this journey. Let's see what we got. And okay, like I said, it looked pretty empty, but what caught my eye, if you look over here, check this out, guys. Lord of the Rings, Pokemon, all these tins. But here's what we were worried about. You could not tell from the photos. Those are empty, empty tins. Okay. Yeah. All empty tins. What do you got here? All right. Now, this is not empty. Here's a Pokemon trading card game. Definitely full. Can't tell if it's new. Don't really want to pull that open. But so we got this one here. That's definitely new or, or in there. Um, and by the way, you guys having a good day today. Let's hope you're having a great day. It's raining here in central Illinois. We got an icky day. And uh, what's going on? What's wrong with something's wrong with this picture today? What is it? I can't. Oh, I know what it is. It is dun dun dun. Trump 2024, guys. If you don't vote Trump, you're a horse's rump. If you vote Biden, you best be hiding. All right, let's get rid of that. We did that for the sake of AI. We think AI might be uh, kind of throwing my videos to the side because of all this. So let's see if that does anything. How about a big thumbs up and a big American flag in the comments saying, I love America. All right, and also, if you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Get in there and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification button. You'll see all the units that we get all the time. We get units all the time. Let's see what else we got without any further ado. All right, let's see. So the story on this unit. Ah, there are some cards in here. Um, the story on this unit, the gentleman got arrested, unfortunately, from stealing from Walmart. Ooh, is that sealed? That's a little, well, no, okay, it's open right there. There's some cards. Um, got arrested from stealing from Walmart uh, for, uh, let's just say possibly stealing Pokemon cards. So, uh, and yeah, so he's in jail. These are these all empty. I see this is all. I was hoping these were full. I was hoping these were full. These are all empty pins. No. What else we got? Oh, is this more? Is this empty? What is this? Oh no, these, this has some weight to it. This has some weight to it. All right, so it looks like in here. Oh, we do have cards. Uh, not in the best shape. And it looks like there are some. Oh, look, there's all kinds of like little building tools and Pokemon stuff. Is that Lego? Is it Lego or is it knockoffs? It's Lego. Okay, so we got some Legos in there. That's good. That's a good sign. This one's heavy. This one's heavy. All right. So looks like we do have lots of cards in here. A little Venom. So, okay, we're going to have some collectibles. Um, hopefully we find some action figures. But this feels really heavy. Yeah, this is really heavy. So we, that V-Star. So we do, have, we do have cards, though, at least. I, got, I won this unit for $360. And with treasures, uh, storage treasures, new rules and regulations, now I have 15% that I had to pay on that, plus tax. So all in, we're in at about $450-ish, somewhere in there. So hopefully there's at least enough to make that back. All right, this is all full of what it feels like, yep. Yeah, all like little pokey things. I don't know what those are worth. Oh, shoot, I'm dropping them everywhere. Looks like some Pokemon pins in there. All right, those could be a couple dollars. Now these look pretty good. These are Batman cards. What? Wait, wait a minute. That's Pokemon, right? Correct? Could be like a made card. And that's Batman. Did they have a crossover, guys? Yeah, look. Wait, wait no. That, uh, what in the heck am I seeing here? 2023. This is brand new. Yeah, it says on there, Pokemon, Nintendo... Game Freak, so maybe some special edition. I, comment down below, guys. I don't know what I'm talking about. Now, I see some of the older cards in here, some of the yellow, good old yellow Pokemon stuff. I do know those. What years do we got here? We got, uh, this looks like 2021. Now, I know some of those can still be worth money. Yep, this one's full. All right. So, at least we do have some full, full. Oh, we got some stuff like that. Hey, is that... Pokemon Trading Card Game 2024. This is brand new. Does that open? I think that's sealed. I don't want to mess with it just in case. Is that something, is that something All important? All the elements it looks like or something yeah, like that. Yeah, is that important, guys? Is that big money? Let me know because I got to make some money back on this one, guys. Trading Putty. Ooh, it's purple. No, I'm not going to try that. 
Don't know what that's for. Oh, peel to reveal. Somebody's fingers have been in that. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's a good thing I didn't lick it. All right, here we go. These are all, these are 2022, but that is all cards at least. Thank goodness. Thank goodness we're not just all empty tins. What have we got in here? That sounds like jewelry. Nope. Ooh, is that sealed? Looks like we got something sealed back there. And it was jewelry of some sort. Let's see. What is that? What do we got? What do we got? A little necklace in here. Let me get it out of there. Nope, not a necklace. Well, I see the chain. So the chain is definitely cheap stuff. And some little crosses. All right. Oh, thank goodness it's not all empty. Oh, that's heavy. Okay, we got more of these little coin Pokemon things in there. Oh, look, there's a bunch of dice. Now, sometimes those dice can be worth some money. So I think we're going to do okay. I think we're going to do okay. We will make our money back at least and have fun doing it. Not every locker is a huge winner, and it could still be a huge winner. You never know what you're going to find, and you don't know what's important in the Pokemon world. I will have to have somebody who knows what they're doing look at this for sure. I need an expert, man. I need to be like the Pawn Stars when I don't know nothing about nothing, and I have to call in an expert. Yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh. Yep, that's a Yu-Gi-Oh. 25th anniversary. Oh, it's full. It's full. Should you see what year this was? Does it say on the bottom 2020? So none of this is very old. Let's hope we find some older stuff along the way. That's down here. Let's see. We got kitchen stuff. What's in this coat? Okay, what do we got here? We got Transformers. All right. We got Transformers. I mean, they're the newer Transformers, but these are still worth a few bucks a piece. We got some... I thought that was Hero Clicks. I don't know what this would be then. I don't know about that guy. Look at that. Blah, he falls apart. But, okay, so we got some, like, little figures. We got some dinosaurs. And we got some Transformers. I'll take it. That's that's much better than a, than a kick in the pants. We got this, uh... Oh, okay, it's a thousand later. Whew. I thought it was a, uh... It was a silverfish. I thought it was a roach. They had a dog. <laughs> and their dog liked to chew on Transformers. So, that's basically... Or Power Rangers, I think. That is. We've got this little baggie here. I see some Minecraft. We got Wonder Woman, Superman, nothing, I don't see no high-end figures, but, you know, nonetheless, there's still some figures, figurage in there, so I figured, and we got some Imaginex, it looks like back here hanging in the back, so let's see what's in here first, I hate ripping up tied up bags, I'll we'll look through this here in a minute and see if there's, make sure there's no uh, family photos, they might be able to take those back. How's it looking, guys? So far, so good, we are finding some of the some some action figures some cards we haven't gotten over to that side yet right now we're, but all of these here were empty but we are finding cards so i think it will we'll at least get our money back for sure and, and you can get it all in there and yeah it's a small unit that'll all fit in there yep. thank you so much that was the manager here she is a sweetheart i've dealt with her many times at this facility She's coming to check on me making sure we did okay this looks like a play-doh kitchen Oh, look, here's a little kitchen. Okay, here, okay, here's the Batman Imagine X. Used to, okay, guys, these used to, I get a lot of money out of. I used to put a couple figures, a couple things in there. There's some figures in there, too. But if you put a couple figures with that, you'd get 30, 40, 50 bucks out of those. Nowadays, if you get $10, you did really well. That stuff just took a dump. There's more Play Doh and kitchen stuff. We've got Spider Man, looks like maybe. Oh, okay, the Minnie Mouse, Minnie Mouse is uh, making some noise at us. This looks like just some plush. Oh, look at this bag. We got more Imagine X. Now look, we got figures in there and everything, so that really helps. That always helps. Oh, it looks like this whole thing. It looks like it's Imagine X, Imagine X. This is all Imagine X and bigger. Uh, uh oh, got a nice little Batmobile there. Turn Batman. Um, it's all, I mean, this is cheaper stuff, but I mean, it's easy to sell, for sure. Let's see. Does he work? Those eye blinks in this chest. I thought maybe it made some noise. I haven't seen this one before. I'm not familiar with that one. Uh, but this is all Imagine X stuff. There's a lot of figures in there. Having the figures is what counts. What do we got here? Uh, first, I thought from a distance of Joe, that is a very cheap, cheap knockoff y type, type guy. We got a bag here that looks like it's got Lego. Lego pieces in it. Are they Lego? Yes, they are Lego at least. <laughs> this over here. Okay, we could see in the picture that there are actually cards over here. But something that we saw that 
piqued our interest was right here, which looks like the same thing as what was over there. So I don't know if these are worth anything. Wait, this way. Okay. I'm not sure if these are worth anything. They look like they would be. They're in the nice hard cases. These are brand new, though. These are 2024s. So they're probably pretty accessible still. But we thought they might be graded that they are not. So boo on that. But still, they're still good right there. It's a little window of this food set, barbecue grill set. It's all cards. That is all Pokemon cards. All Pokemon. So let's see. We got these are 2023s. But, I mean, look how stacked and packed that is in there. And I am betting, I am betting you that oh, every one of these, oh, yeah. Hear that? Every one of these is the same thing. Every one. So, Pokemon card. Yeah, look. Nope, these are Yu-Gi-Oh's. What year yu gi do we got? These are 2020s. And I don't know if there's anything valuable in there, but I know just for pure bulk of all of this, we're going to do okay. Definitely cards. Let's see what kind we got. What do we get in here? Electrical tape. What a booger to pull. All right. Yep, all cards. What kind are these? These are Yu-Gi-Oh's. So we got Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh mixed up in here. Same thing, 2020. These are 2020s, a little bit older. Okay, so we got some 2020s. Now, I don't know on any of these what's old, what the old is and what the new is. Does it, does it say on here? What's it say? Cards. Rare. Oh, rare. Cards rare. All right. These are the rare cards, guys. This is the money right here. Boy, has he got this stuff taped up, though. I don't want to... Oh, boy. Electrical tape. Oh, okay. So it's starting to open right there. Is this all really real, rare cards? We don't do. And I don't want to spill them out. Don't make that mistake. So what do you guys think so far, man? Comment down below. Do you think we did okay on this? Okay, so this says rare cards. These are 2020s. See, I don't have, I have no idea on any of these cards what's what. I really do not. So, it does say rare. Let's hope he was right. Let's hope he was a connoisseur of the cards and knew what he was talking about. Looks like Pokemon cards to me. Just out of the sheer bulk. Just out of sheer bulk, I think we did. Okay. These are 2022. What else we got down in here? Let's see if we got any other years in here. 23, 22. So, okay, so once again, all cards. So, so it's just a mixture. And then I was hoping that these were the better ones because they were like actually sitting here and out. Um, still don't know what we got though. Let's see what, take a little gander of these. Ooh, those look like nicer cards. These are 23s, but I don't know anything about Pokemon. So I can't tell you, are they good? Are they bad? We're not going to take the 17 hours it would take to go through them all together, but okay, let's see. Look, yeah, we got some shiny ones. I know the shiny ones are a little bit better desirable. 23s, though. Uh, we're still in, you know, 23. Oh, let's look right here. We got, yep, definitely full. Definitely full. These are all going to be full. Yeah, everything over here seems full. Yep, those are all full. This is more of the Yu Gi Oh with Batman. I mean, the Batman's in there. Or oh, everybody, what should I be looking for? If you know Pokemon, tell me down below, what is it that I'm looking for? This is, I know Charizard, but those are the older ones that are worth money. These are 23s, but they look like they're, a lot of them are like hologram type. I know the hologram sometimes can be worth some money. Uh, this whole Pepsi thing, boom, Pokemon. Let me see. 2021. You guys seen anything in there? I know nothing about nothing about Pokemon. What year do we got? These are Mr. Beast. Twenties. Where? I'm sorry. What's that say? No right. Oh, down there. Is he gonna come out? Is Mr. Beast here? Is Mr. Beast Is Mr. in the locker? Beast here? Okay. Is he in the locker? Is Mr. Beast gonna give me ten thousand dollars? Does it shoot money? Does it, it should shoot money. What does it shoot? <laughs> oh, it's a oh, it shoots orb. Uh, Little orbs, uh, what do you call them? Orbs, right? Mr. Beast promo? Let's see. <laughs> does, it, does it have power? Oh! <laughs> no, oh, that's not. Me. That's not. <laughs> Dude, that bounces. <laughs> Thank God don't hurt. Nobody's gonna get our stuff from our unit. We found a loaded gun in this unit. 
Mr. Beast, come pay me. I have your gun. <laughs> All right, that's pretty cool. That's kind of neat. That's different to find. Mr. Mr. Beast. All right, let's see. Here we go. We got uh, 2022. All these seem to be a lot newer. Kind of cool little RC cars. Look at these guys right here work too. Those are like right there, right there. Yeah, a little remote. Battle bot. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are heavy. I wish just one of these would be sealed, though. If we could get just one of these guys sealed, then we'd be talking money. I know this is a sleeve. Yeah, if one of these were sealed, these go for several hundred dollars sealed. I got some from a, from a picker the other day. This tape sucks. This tape is awful. I'm using electrical tape on Pokemon stuff. Let's go real slow. Oh, that's slowly, slowly. All right. Ta-da. It's full. It is full. These are 2022s. Come on, are Yu-Gi-Oh, though. I think those are Yu-Gi-Oh. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Wired remote. Oh, that's for one of the cars. Okay, wired remote Velociraptor. Then this, once again, I don't think that's what it says. I, it feels pretty heavy. I think this is... Oh, yeah, this is full of cards for sure. Full of cards for sure. Wish you would have been into, like, video games and comic books, man. I was really hoping some of these would be comic books. I'm going to say these are cards. What? I mean... Just out of the amount, the sheer amount of cards that I have, there's no way I can lose money. There's no way. I'm trying to get some of these out. We'll see what year these are. Yep, they're Pokemons. And they are 2022 on the top, anyway. I'm not getting anything in sleeves yet. Oh, no. We got more Pokemons. These are sitting out. Are these rare? 23. It almost looks like a whole set of silver ones of some sort. So we'll kind of keep those to the side and on their own little bag there. A little box. We got these here are, well, these are silver ones too, so 2023s again. And what could be in here? I can tell you right now, just by the feel of it, that is all cards. We're not going to open those right now. All these seem to be new. Ain't no sense in it. 2023s. So apparently it's new at this. Guys, that feels like cards. Is it? Nope, it's crayons. <laughs> I was wrong on that, huh? We got some erasers, some crayons, some glue. It's a school bag. Felt like cards. Got another little remote. Uh, more of the gel fires for the Mr. Beast gun. We got some cards. That's an, I think that's just a power bank. And just some miscellaneous. Yeah, that's pretty gross. Yeah, belt rule. Those are one of those. Are some kind of waffle maker. Pretty much all garage sale or garbage. We got a backpack, backpack, what's in the backpack? I mean, this wasn't like a household unit, so we're finding some weird different stuff. A little uh, Bluetooth speaker. Oh, uh, why? Wow. How? Okay, guys. Kids toys, Pokemon, and Pokemon. Mm. Is that what all this is? Oh, yes, it no, is. Oh, oh, it's oh no. Okay. What were you doing in there, Elf? Okay, what were elf, you doing? Elf on the shelf getting frisky. Elf on a shelf had a, oh boy. Oh, yee -hee. oh yeah. Um, this whole bag. Yeah, dude. you don't want to see what's in here. I'm, oh, ew, I'm just hoping there's something. Don't touch well, it. Well, let's just say, I'll show you the easy mm. stuff. Ooh, that one goes in a different spot. Stop. Ooh, Put the bag up. That one goes in a different spot. Ew. Every one of them. Why? Stop putting your hand I'm in the bag. I'm looking for something good. Like there's no, no, there's lube in there. There could I be seen golden nipple clamps in there. <laughs> you dirty elf! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Always. Why? Every locker. You guys are dirty. You're dirty. Just, Just throw it away if you're not using it. Get your dirty right crap either. out of the lockers. <laughs> Flowers. Flowers. All right. <laughs> there was a flower in there. I'm going to tell you what that flower was for. Flare in there. This looks like uh, airplanes, little flying airplanes. It looks kind of cool. Um, all right, we got some hats. Some different hats. What, what is that? Anybody know what that is? A rate? I rate? Is that a brand? Is that a... Uh, must be a brand name. I don't know anything about that. 
this feels like definitely just some blankets, maybe a pillow inside. Yeah, maybe a pillow in there. We got some, this looks like a, oh, there we go, that's kind of cool. A bunch of little Hot Wheels. There's a little Lotus Esprit. Those are awesome cars. Um, little Hot Wheels, little Hot Wheels track thing that folds out. That's kind of cool. My little pony, sweet little pony. Yeah, you keep your eyes closed. Did you see what was in that backpack? She don't want to know. All right, we got the unicorn stomper truck. We got some uh, Hot Wheels tracks in here. Just some of these little uh, kind of Play-Doh type things. Uh, I'm more into open stuff now. Now stuff's, stuff's getting kind of creepy. Nope, at least that's little kid stuff. Yep, yep, that's, oh, that's Polly Pocket. That's a whole bunch of little Polly Pocket stuff. We are almost, almost done here with that reef. This reef are loud. We're filming here! All right. God, you get no respect. We got some personal. Uh, looks like some hard hat toys. Down to the last coat. Hey, all right. We got some Nerf, the Nerfs. We got more of the Power Ranger Transformer type stuff in here. Bunch of that. This might not be a bad little box. Check that out. We got little action figures and stuff. I see Halo. I see Pokemon. A little uh, My Arcade game. I'd like to find like a DS or something. I wouldn't dig all the way through here, but it, well, there might be some good stuff down here, guys. This feels like Legos or building blocks of some sort. Oh, it's Micro Machines. Even better. All right, we got Micro Machines. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead and dig into it a little bit. The backpack never bothered me anyway. Well, it bothers me, lady. All right, let's see what we got. We got uh, oh, just random little kids' toys. This little tables and chairs and peoples. And, and so they had a little boy and a little girl. All right, this one's got tape on it. What do we got in here? Oh, this tape is driving me nuts. All right, there you go. Uh, who's that? Um, Bluey. It's like the yeah, yeah. Blue. I was trying to remember their name. So those are actually pretty cool to have. Those are good. Take those out to the flea market. People will buy those up. There's a lot of these little tins in here. Yeah, just just on the little toys alone, guys. We got our money back probably. Look at all those little guys. That's some good little stuff. I see uh, calico critters in there. I see Paw Patrol. I see Pokemon. I see My Little Pony. I see an Olaf from Frozen. A little bit of everything down there. There's a bunch of these too. This is all right. These are always fun to find. That? that looks like just clothes. My Little Pony stuff. My Little Pony stuff. And once again, it's all newer. Not vintage, so we don't have that going for us. But, you know, the kids... This is the stuff you can take out to flea markets or whatever. And kids will, you know, will have enough money that they can buy a few things. More of the blues. I see Peckle the Pig. I see Paw Patrol. So there's some good stuff in there. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Looking for... for trying to find one of those wow factors. Man, I got a lot of stuff that shoots things. Check this out. Oh. I was expecting that one to be hurting. Thank <laughs> God. There's another one. All right. The ball blasters. They were blasting some balls, all right. <laughs> all right. Let's see. We got just little play sets. More play sets. Little kids' camera. Um, over on this side, we got some dinosaur action going. More of the, the Power Ranger Transformer guys. Those are good, and I was hoping to find that, like, DS or something down in there. I don't think we're going to find a DS. we got action figures. You know, nothing too great. Um, Joker's good. I'm going to buy the Joker. Oh, we got all the way down here. What is that? Oh, that's kind of cool. What's on there? I thought maybe that was, like, a, a cartoon series or something. I think it's just a pretty random cheap toy. I was hoping it was like, you know, had a theme to it. Marvel or something like that. What are these here? Well, it's more Hot Wheels stuff for sure. How does it open? I don't want to break it. Oh, just like that. Oh, that might not be Hot Wheels. I wonder who made that. Let's see. That newer Mighty Max or, or let's see. That is uh, manufactured by Moose. <laughs> by Moose. Who's Moose? Moose and Squirrel. All right. All right. We got some more toys down in here. More cars, more more uh, stomper type stuff. 
But it seems to me it's basically all regular little toys. Well, there's one bag. Here we go. Here's that. that feels like, that sounds like Legos. Is it Legos? Yep, that is Legos. So, is it Lego though? Yes, it is. So we got a little bag of Legos in here. So we'll have to go see what we got. By looking at all this stuff around here, I'm saying either My Little Pony, maybe Fortnite, something like that. But hey guys, that wraps this unit up. Wait, no, it doesn't. We have a few things in the front. Let's go see what's in the front. What has got me a, a, a unicorn? Oh, oh, hey, it's one of those. Listen to it, cool. Where's the little thing that you flip it to clear it? There we go. See that? See how that works? I don't know if you guys have seen these before. Cool little drawing pads for kids. You can draw whatever you want on it, and then it's got a button you press, and it all disappears. Pretty cool. That's fun. I didn't see these bags. Did we see? We didn't go through these. Did we? Uh, more. This looks like a towel. What's in the? I'm almost afraid of bags now. That backpack. I'm gonna have nightmares. Nothing. Those go to the wall of shame, guys. This looks like makeup. Yeah, makeup. But is there any jewelry? Did you guys leave any jewelry behind? Any time. We have got a, oh my goodness, yeah. Okay, these are the kind of guys that just pushed it to the limits. Look at that. They're like, nah, this tire's fine. It's been holding there. <laughs> yep, okay, so that is garbage. Um, we got like some stuff out of the car. Looks like they just threw it out. U brackets. Uh, that's a little hitch of some sort. Ball mount hitch thing. For a small hitch, it's not very important. Looks like some uh, jumper cable things for a battery pack. Umbrella. This is pretty good. A little hitch receiver. Uh, I might be able to use that on my van, actually. And money saved is money earned. There's the little 400 watt Everstart uh, jump start pack. So if that works, that's kind of cool. Looks like a battery. And if it's any good, that's, that's, that's good to have. There's nothing else. It's like $5 for recycle and or you can use it to exchange. So uh, they're not going nowhere. They got a busted ass tire and a bad battery. All right. And this looks like probably clean rags and stuff. And right here we have a, oh, laser distance meter. One of those uh, digital meters that tells you how far things are. Well, that's kind of cool and it works. So that's pretty neat. And this looks like just blah. And we got some wheel adapters and a flashlight with no battery. And some groupings. All right. So other than that, guys, this unit is done. If you stay with us till the end, congratulations. Thank you so much. If you're still here, type Pokemon in the comments. And that way we know that you stay till the end. And congratulations, you have won absolutely nothing. But until next time, we love each and every one of you. We will see you very, very soon. Have a great week. Bye-bye.